Hey guys, I am packing up to go home and I wanted to use this opportunity to show you my hoop bags. All right, the reason, the reason I am showing you is because these hoop bags are fabulous. I've made myself hoop bags before and they always rip generally on this seam right here. And I got sick of dealing with them, so I got a hold of April because I know she is a fantastic seamstress. And I said, here's some material, will you make me some hoop bags? And she made these fantastic bags that have lasted me a year. And what they have is a paracord pull tie right here. And it snips through this little thing right here. And there is enough to where you could tie it if you want, but I've never had to. You just slip it through there and you can pull it tight and it'll cinch right up and it's just there. Um, I have a lot of hoops in here and there is room for more. This is my bag for my small hoops. We have what about this many small kids hoops going on right here. This is my 30 inch bag. And it's a little loose because I don't actually have any 30s going on in here right now. The biggest hoop I have in here right now is a 26. So we've got some wiggle room. I just pop that right through there. And to be honest, when I don't have a smaller hoop, I don't even use that. Let me show you my bigger hoop bag. I have three of these bags. I have small hoops, big hoops, and LED hoops, which I didn't bring with me today. So I have just made a material order for more of this exact same material in different colors. I asked you guys what you wanted. So I've just made a material order for more of this mesh material in different colors. And you know what, let me show you one thing that I really love about this material is that it is not bulky at all. Look how small that wads up to. It's it's not a big, thick, cotton blend, anything. It's heavy duty and it, it's heavy duty and it's durable. It's a little see-through, <laughs> but it's mesh jersey material and I love that it is not bulky. So when I have all my hoops out, these big bags aren't making a big deal everywhere. So this is my 36 inch bag, and I actually have a 37 inch hoop in here right now, so it's a little tight, but it still works. I like to stick one, I like to stick just one in there first. I think that helps just get it open, that way you're not struggling, you just get one in, and then you can go for the gusto. And roll them all right in there, get one side in, Go around and you can see how many hoops I have going on here. I have quite a stack and there is room for quite a bit more. Quite a bit more hoops. And then roll it over here to this side where I've got my purple, purple paracord. And I'm gonna flip it over here, show ya the little loop, which to be honest, I wouldn't even loop it right now unless say, So I probably wouldn't even loop it right now unless I had like a tiny hoop I was also carrying with me. Because sometimes you have a tiny hoop in a big bag. Well, sometimes it'll fall out, but it seems to stay pretty good in this one. But for safety, I would loop it through here and I wouldn't tie it unless I wanted to and I'd just pull it tight and that holds the hoop right up in there, and you can tuck this in too. If you don't like it hanging, you just tuck it. And that way, my little hoop is not gonna fall out of the bag. So, yeah, I just wanna show you what this product is all about, and it's about functionality and durability, and it's on spot. On spot if you've got a lot of hoops or just a few hoops, and you can get whatever diameter, you want, like I said, I have a big hoops bag. 
a small hoops bag, and an LED bag, and they're awesome. <laughs> you can even hoop your hoop bag. All right, thanks for watching the video. Get yourself a hoop bag. You'll love it. You'll love it. Sorry, my face was cut off in most of this. Oh, you get them at www.monarchhoopsanddance.com. That is two H's and two D's. I get that question a lot. Two H's, two D's, yes. Monarch, hoops, and dance. You got it. Thanks, guys. You're awesome. Have fun hooping.